Hello! Today, we'll be showing you how to replace the palm rest assembly on a Samsung XE500 C13 Chromebook. First, you will need a few tools. An anti-static mat is recommended to avoid electrostatic discharge which can damage electronic parts. A small, magnetic tip Phillips head screwdriver will be necessary for this replacement. A spudger will also come in handy for this replacement. You can use either plastic or metal, whichever you prefer. You might also want to have a pair of tweezers handy as they may be useful in handling small parts. The first step will be to remove the nine bottom cover screws. Next, you will use your spudger to carefully pry and remove the bottom cover. Now, you will remove the four battery screws. Next, you will disconnect the battery cable from the motherboard and remove the battery. Now, you will disconnect the motherboard to daughterboard cable from the motherboard. Next, you will disconnect the touchpad cable from the motherboard. Now, you will disconnect the keyboard cable from the motherboard. Next, you will disconnect the motherboard speaker cable from the motherboard. Next, you will disconnect the LCD cable from the motherboard. Next, you will remove the seven motherboard screws. While you're removing the motherboard screws, you will also remove the metal bracket above the HDMI and USB ports. Now, you will remove the motherboard. 
Now, you will disconnect the daughter board speaker cable from the daughter board. Next, you will disconnect the two Wi-Fi antenna cables from the Wi-Fi card. Now, you will remove the four daughter board screws. Three of the daughter board screws are also holding the metal daughter board bracket, which you will also remove. Once the screws are removed, you can remove the daughter board. Next, you will remove the four hinge screws. Now, you can push the hinges forward and remove the palm rest assembly from the top assembly. The first step in the installation of your replacement palm rest assembly will be to line up the hinges and replace the four hinge screws. Now, you will put the daughter board and daughter board bracket into place and replace the four daughter board screws. Next, you will reconnect the two Wi-Fi antenna cables to the Wi-Fi card. Now, you will reconnect the daughter board speaker cable to the daughter board. Next, you will set the motherboard back into place and replace the seven motherboard screws. Be sure to replace the metal bracket above the HDMI and USB ports before replacing the screws on the right side of the motherboard.
Now, you will reconnect the LCD cable to the motherboard. Now, you will reconnect the motherboard speaker cable to the motherboard. Next, you will reconnect the keyboard cable to the motherboard. Now, you will reconnect the touchpad cable to the motherboard. Next, you will reconnect the motherboard to daughterboard cable to the motherboard. Next, you will set the battery into place and replace the four battery screws. Now, you will reconnect the battery cable to the motherboard. Next, you will snap the bottom cover back into place. The final step will be to replace the nine bottom cover screws. You have now successfully replaced the palm rest assembly on your Samsung Chromebook. Good job!